The icon of the entry into Jerusalem is most striking. We see our Lord seated upon a colt of a donkey. The donkey's head is bowed low and a child is feeding the donkey. To the right is pictured the walled city of Jerusalem and at the gate are the assembled elders. One is holding a palm branch, hailing him as the son of David, the Messiah, but another is whispering, one is looking away, yet another is looking towards the palm tree and the remainder are looking at each other. They seem skeptical observers to the event. Their faces portray the overarching question which is voiced in the Gospel of Matthew, Who is this? Is this the Messiah riding on a donkey? Our Lord himself in the middle of the scene has his head inclined towards his disciples who are following him to the left of the icon. He is looking to see if they are still there. In a few days time, of course, they would not be. Only the beloved disciple remained faithful. The others hid and fled. One denied him and another betrayed him. Behind our Lord's head is the Mount of Olives, outside the city where he would be handed over to the authorities. The only ones who are active in this scene are the small children. One is cutting the branches from the tree and two others are strewing branches and garments before Christ's path as tokens of honor for one who is acknowledged as a king. They are often pictured in white garments for purity. In their childlike innocence and enthusiasm, only they are truly engaged in this historic ride into Jerusalem. The city of Jerusalem is shown as the walled buildings, and the temple is depicted as the building with the dome.